Hello, everyone, and welcome to Mystic Door Tarot. This is Barb with your daily tarot card reading for Tuesday, August 6, 2024. Today, we have Major Arcana card, The Tower. So, today we have the energy of the Major Arcana card, the Tower, and yesterday we had the Emperor, an energy of relaxed readiness, being up for anything. Now, the Tower card it gets a bad rap most of the time, as it's always perceived in a negative way. That can be the case sometimes, but it is a major arcana card. So first and foremost, it could be a life event, something that's coming in, something that's happening, maybe a new direction, maybe what would be considered a blessing in disguise. As the tower card shows up indicating significant change is needed, and possibly for some of you, because that change did not happen, it is now the universe thrusting this change upon you. So think of the tower card showing up as significant change that could be coming in to move you in a better direction. Again, blessings in disguise, and you won't really realize it at the, at the moment today. What might be taking place is going to actually benefit you later on in a most significant way. Now, for some of you, it's going to be very apparent that uh, the change that's coming in, you might actually be making the change yourself. So you have more of a control over the tower energy today. But yesterday, having the emperor, that is about being assertive and taking action and knowing which direction you want to go in, what you want to achieve. So some of you could have already put this tower energy into motion, making significant changes for a better life, a better journey, a better outcome for your future. Now, the card that we're looking at in the Hobbit tarot deck, this is the dragon smog just spewing fire to wreak havoc, revenge, destroying the town of Dale and capturing the lonely mountain and with it all its treasure inside. So the meaning behind this is the need to build on solid foundations. So some of you might be suddenly realizing the truth about someone or something today. It's a massive upheaval and yes, maybe sudden chaos because it's something quite unexpected that could happen today. Most likely this could be sudden change coming from outside forces. All the more reason with having the Emperor card yesterday where you're prepared, you're ready, you know what direction you're going to take. That relaxed readiness, you're on alert already. So with the Tower card showing up, it's better to accept the changes rather than trying to resist them. So not even a full week into August and every single one of the cards we receive from day one is telling the story how the energy is building and what is needed to move forward. But the key here is possibly sudden change from outside forces, things that you don't have control over. So the Tower card coming in today can represent like a big world event. It can be a global pandemic or it can be something much, much smaller, an argument with a loved one a disruption to a very comfortable routine. Now, we are now in Mercury retrograde, which is currently in Virgo. We'll be moving into Leo in about another week in retrograde. Upheaval, change, miscommunication. It can create this kind of tower moment. So be careful what you're saying. Think about what you want to say before you say it. Be clear. Now, we do know the outcome of a tower situation is unpredictable. But you can be sure that something will be permanently altered. Change and uncertainty can be very uncomfortable, even frightening at times. But the tower helps us by showing what in our lives is unsustainable or weak or false or needs to go. So the tower comes in, shakes up our lives. We then gain clarity about what's most important and where our strengths lie and what we need to eliminate. So this is a major arcana card. It is ruled by Mars with the numerology of number seven. So again, with it being a major arcana card, that is very unique energy. 
Certainly can be very transformative energy where this could be life events, spiritual insights, changing relationships, changing jobs, moving house. The major arcana cards encourage you to explore the bigger picture of what's really going on. Now, with it being ruled by Mars, that is the emperor energy yesterday as well, symbolizing action, being assertive. The energy is very dynamic, motivating, encouraging, initiative, determination, and the pursuit of your goals. As Mars fuels ambition and also the ability to overcome challenges that might come your way today with this tower energy coming in. And of course, the seven numerology, spiritual in its essence, it's all about introspection, the quest for wisdom, encouraging you to journey inward, growing through self-awareness. But again, seven pertains to things that we do not have control over that's happening around us. And that is what I believe the tower moment is suggesting today. So it could be something more worldwide where you get affected by it in some way, shape, or form. Maybe your beliefs or what you care about. Or it could be something that is actually happening to you today. Changing jobs, changing relationships, changing house, as I said before. And the crystals that are specifically associated with the tower card are garnet, ruby, obsidian, magnetite, chrysocolla, hematite. All have amazing properties to meditate with where you might be confronting the truth of the matter at hand. It's enlightenment, finding out something about someone or something. It's also in regards to helping you release outdated ideas and beliefs, so truly crystals of liberation. Major iconic card, the tower coming in, could be blessings in disguise, and it's not going to feel too good at the moment. But you'll realize later why this was necessary for some of you. And it certainly could be turning the corner, moving on, moving up. This could be a job, career, new company, new position. For others, in regards to love, this could be relationships. This could be letting go of someone. Um, you know, you feel it, it, it no longer feels as, as it, you thought it was going to go, you know, how it was going to grow into that particular re relationship. In other words, it's going south. <laughs> And you're now embarking out on a new journey to find that perfect match. Keep in mind, though, with the Tower card showing up right when Mercury is now in retrograde, it is a time of double and triple checking any kind of contracts, agreements, documents. And be careful with your communication. Be crystal clear in regards to what you actually want to express. As the Tower moment paired with the Mercury retrograde, could cause chaos, confusion, upset in regards to your communication. Well, that is the energy for today. Thank you so much for joining me. Love and abundance. Until tomorrow.